A spat has broken out between two physicists, one particle and the other astro, over what the interstellar object 3i Atlas is. One is the high-profile British professor and science popularizer Brian Cox, and the other, the Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb. For months now, Loeb has said that the scientific community ought to at least keep the possibility that 3i Atlas could be of alien technological nature in the mix of explanations about what it really is. Loeb has generally maintained that while he thinks it is most likely a comet, as a matter of scientific practice, scientists should remain curious and not dismiss even a small chance that 3i Atlas may be technological and not natural. In support, he cites 10 anomalies about the object. In contrast, Cox has dismissed Loeb's view as drivel, insisting that 3i Atlas is an interstellar comet made of carbon dioxide and ISIS. In response, Loeb has brushed aside Cox as a commentator who has not presented a single scientific paper on the subject while he has published 11 papers. In case you are underwhelmed by the intensity of the spat between Loeb and Cox, let me tell you in the world of nerds, which I also inhabit, this is the equivalent of a brass knuckle street fight. Drivel, burn, commentator, burn. In the meantime, 3i Atlas tears across our solar system at an extraordinary 200,000 plus kilometers an hour. At this stage, I'm rooting for 3 Atlas not to be an alien spaceship or a technological remnant from an advanced civilization. That is because, as someone more interested in things primal about the universe, it would be so much more fascinating if the object turned out to be a rock that is between 7 and 10 billion years old. The fact that we witnessed an object possibly more than twice as old as our solar system is astounding enough for me. If it is indeed 10 billion years old, as one study suggested, then we are looking at a rock from a time when the universe was barely 3.8 billion years old. Think about that fact alone and be thrilled.